Hey, it's Dr. Gonzo and you're watching In a Nutshell. Today I was going to talk to you about how do we manage patients that have mitral valve insufficiency due to functional mitral insufficiency. Now remember in the, one of the previous videos I talked to you about what functional mitral valve looks like. In that situation, the walls to which the mitral valve attached to has stretched out, causing the mitral valve to shift from this point to this point, allowing for a gap to occur between the two leaflets of the mitral valve. What that means is that blood, rather than moving in this direction, blood starts leaking back to where it came from, which is the left atrium and the lungs, causing conditions like we call congestive heart failure. Now the solution for this type of problem, is kind of a simple one. What we do is we put a belt around the mitral valve. Now this is the mitral valve as you would see it in a surgical view. And what we do is we put a ring and suture it around the mitral valve annulus. That's like a belt. It sort of brings everything back together so that way instead of the valve being stretched out like this, you reestablish the normal geometry of the valve allowing for the mitral valve leaflets to kiss again. And that's functional mitral valve repair in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.